Hello everybody. Uh, a couple of weeks ago I did a video showing the Rebec, the ancestor to the violin that I did. Today I have my next project. The other half to the lathe work. Now, to give a quick little explanation, you to do these kind of instruments, uh, the e best effective way that I found to do it is to take your two wood blanks, since they're constructed from a solid piece of wood, take your two wood blanks, it's best to do them in pairs because it's done on a lathe, you put the two pieces of wood together and you turn the exterior of the body on the wood lathe in one piece and then you take a chisel and split it down the middle and that gives you your two half shells which then you hollow out and you would use a a feeler gauge to check the thickness on the wall and you want to shave that wall down to where it is somewhere between uh, a eighth of an inch and three thirty seconds something along those lines uh, you're for the metrics there you're talking about three to four millimeters thick through the entire shell and from there you have your option as to what kind of instrument that you want to produce. La uh, two weeks ago I showed you my Rebic project and this week I'm sh going to show you its kid brother, uh, the Gitern. The Gitern is an instrument that came from roughly the same time period uh, the late Middle Ages, 13th, 14th century, and it is got a lot in common with the Rebec as far as construction, except that here the Gitern is the predecessor to the lute and mandolin family. All right. This is a three-stringer uh, Gitern the frets, let me see if I can show you the frets here, the, the frets I've used a diatonic scale um, much the same kind of a fretboard that you would find with the dulcimer family it's diatonic and in fact being three strings and the dulcimer fretboard this will play very similar to playing a mountain dulcimer or the popular strum sticks that are running around. simple instrument, very primitive type of instrument, and it's constructed the, the back like the Rebec was carved on the lathe out of a block of cherry wood. I made a little difference with this, the soundboard, the soundboard of this Rebec, of this Gitern is River Bottom Cypress. This is a piece that I shaved down from a piece of cypress that had been salvaged off of a river bottom and had probably been there for a few hundred years. It's a it's very tight grain. You can see here it's a very tight grain, very straight grain, and I believe it would make an excellent tone wood. So, so I used it as the soundboard for this. The fret board, fingerboard, and tailpiece, once again, black walnut. And 
it's got a few adjustments and yes it's out of tune bad but I just got it completed and once again this is something that I barely know anything about playing I just enjoyed building them and maybe my next video uh, now that I'm starting to get a little custom to it I'll show you some of what I'm doing inside the shop and some of the steps towards building an instrument like this. Thank you very much, and may God bless you abundantly.